on what was supposed to be a glorious wedding day, I still pronounce him the new EWA heavyweight champion. <laughs> Golden, you did it, pal! <laughs> you know, it's just like, it's just like I said. Diamonds are forever. Diamonds are forever. We had this plan the whole time. Nobody, nobody saw it coming. I said it last week. I was brought here to be an enforcer, and tonight was my night. This is what I was talking about. This is the proof. The proof is in the gold. You know, when I came here, when I first got here, I said, <laughs> my name wasn't the only thing that was going to have gold in it. Tonight, I made good on my promise. <laughs> <laughs> he raises a very valid point. See, diamonds are forever, and we prove that tonight. The battles, they come and go, but the long run, the marathon, not the sprint, the war, that is where the diamonds, each and every time, <laughs> manage to settle the score. The EWA's always stood for the finest in traditional New England independent wrestling talent, and this man right here represents that to a T. We have the best manager in New England wrestling today leading us into the ring every time, and some of the savviest veterans around in myself and Johnny Idol. And how can we forget Royalty William King, who we did not have the good services of tonight as he is recuperating, and of course, the lovely Mercedes KV. You may beat us once, but we will always come out just a little bit further ahead in the end. Or, on a night like tonight, when Joe Eastman's left lying and crying, <laughs> Mikazi doesn't have any gold around his waist, <laughs> and we're smiling at the end of the day. Man, it feels good to be a diamond. <laughs> <laughs> oh!